Hey guys, not that you need another reason to buy Commander 2016. Wizards of the Coast is doing a very good job making casual cards and reprinting. So full credit to them. But each of the Commander decks will have four of these recommended Commanders. Some were Partner and then the four Color Commander. They will each have four foil cards. Normal foil, not the double rainbow foil which is not the good one. So we will have the normal foil, premium foils of the four card commanders and the new Commander 2016 decks. I feel like that is uh, very good. I would much rather have regular size cards that are foil that I can play with. And it's crazy because this is unique because some of these cards are coming out, the first printing of these cards are in foil. Uh, including the ones that we're going to look at right now. I can imagine that they will look amazing in foil. And there's really no reason. I mean, when you kind of look at some EDH foil prices versus the non-foil prices, there can be a multiplier of 5, 10, sometimes 20 for very rare and hard to find cards. There's no reason for that. Why don't we just make, you know, the commander's foil? And then everyone can buy a foil commander. And not only did they get one, they get four. I'm most excited for these two foils in particular. I think they're going to look amazing and wow. You know, it is a wow because the first time we will ever see these cards in print, they will be in foil. Four commanders, extra value. I view that as extra value because. You know, a lot of times when the older commander cards, they're printed as judge promos and they get kind of pricey, not too pricey, but pricey enough to indicate that they should have been foils to begin with. I like where they're going with this and I don't see this hurting anyone. Uh, definitely, it's going to make it more easy to pimp out your deck should you want to do that, especially pimp out your commander, which uh, is pretty cool in my opinion, adding additional value to your already value filled Commander 2016 definitely a great product and one that I would advise you to pick up uh, but no rush you shouldn't pay over MSRP for it because guess what it will be Walmart's Targets and probably Walgreens Toys R Us definitely Toys R Us um, definitely Walgreens too I always see magic cards at Walgreens anyway bye guys